Hello everybody, welcome back to 7 Days to Die. We are on day 2 of the Alpha 20, which is awesome, first off. Secondly, look at that infection rating, and oh my gosh, it's also dark. Uh, we're hiding inside of a box because we have feral stuff turned on, so we're just waiting for it to actually tick over to daytime. I don't want to take a chance that we're going to get seen. Um, I don't have a whole lot of healing items or anything else like that, so we're trying to be very, very careful. Uh, did we get any points? I think I actually put all of those into their proper places at the end of the day. We don't even have boots right now, guys. We are not doing just all that great yet. We should be good. Okie dokie. Um, it would be nice if we could go ahead and fill up our food. That way, if we get injured, we can heal up. Uh... Let's just toss that in there. Do we have anything else? Yes. Um, we're going to take our money with us because we're hopefully going to be able to get some more food. I would like to make, what, like 30 more frames? Let's go ahead and craft those. Let those be on the go. Uh, put that in my hotbar. Okay, okay. Oh, I don't need... I, I don't need... These. Hang on. I did see some kind of healing. This could be useful. Let's do it like that. Like that. Uh, let's not put that in the hot bar. Let's do that. We've got a knife. We've got... Alright. We didn't actually get very far during our first day. So, let's see. we got to wait for the trader to open. What we can do is go around and loot a few things. Um, let's get out here. 8.2, it would be a good idea for us to loot some trash, see if maybe, perhaps, hopefully, we can <laughs> find something to heal up the infection. Uh, let's go ahead and take that. We did kind of take over this place without checking any of the containers. Let's go ahead and get that out of the way. Close that door in case anybody comes up. A bit of water. Okay. Some kind of healing would be nice. You know, antibiotic would be good. Please. Like, practically impossible to find antibiotics in this game, I swear. And then this. Let's see what else we can find. Vehicle off road headlights mod schematic okay and we have this I'm not sure if that's helpful right this second but we'll hold on to it okay we're just waiting for the trader to open let's go around check a whole bunch of trash a whole bunch of cars see if we can find some tree stumps and get rid of this infection five brass doorknobs five of them and during the whole time i was playing the experimental weekend i didn't find a single tool uh, stone tool anywhere in any of the loot so I guess the loot table was changed just a little bit to inclu include those so that's that's a thing it would be cool if we could make a pipe pistol or something like that so let's make sure we get some pipes today let's check these trash cans back here too We might be to use that to help make pockets, so the sewing kit is a nice thing to see. A whole bunch of random stuff. I wonder if there's something interesting inside that building right there. We can stick our head in and find out. A pipe machine gun. Found a pipe machine gun. Heck yeah, dude. I don't actually have any of my ammo on me, so... Okay. I don't hear anything. I don't hear sleepy zombie sounds or nothing like that. I have no idea the best place to find the honey nowadays because it is certainly... Woo! Good grief. Good morning. Uh, come out here. There we go. Alright, so today's job... Um, 
Just so you guys know, I do actually have a direction I'm going with with my playthrough. I don't know precisely when we are going to be heading in that direction. I just want to be absolutely sure that the map is not going to break whenever we hit stable. So we're going to take it slow and see how it goes. Uh, Jason Speed 401 has subscribed. Um, is there a way? Okay. Maybe there's a way to get up there from the outside, or am I supposed to go through here? Let me up. Let me up. Let me up. No. Thank God, I was so close. There is a bag back there. Um, there we go. I do not have a shovel yet. Might want to look into that. But as I'm not really... Okay. Uh, we do have a mission. I just realized that. I've been sitting here waiting for the trader. We do have a mission we could go do. Let's go drop off and go do that mission. I was supposed to say, let's go pick up a quest. We picked up a quest yesterday, my bad. But this whole car park, that whole park right here, is is that what I'm trying to do here? Please tell me that's not the case. That's a few buildings. Yep, that's a few buildings. Alright. Maybe we'll find food. There's a lot of kitchens. Between all of these, there's a lot of kitchens. Freddy is on the way. Hello? Now, my only fear is I think there's at least one dog somewhere in this POI. Hi, Thick, how you doing? I just totally missed that head right there, dude. Wait, wait for it. Just trying to get my stamina back. Okay. Should I worry about tearing those things down? I don't think so. I have like zero of that. Yeah, I can stab him. Nope. <laughs> Didn't happen. <laughs> I need arrows. Marilyn, where'd you come from? Okay, I've got... I've got that. I need feathers. That's what I was out of. Okay. All of the jars, please. I need to go get some water. Get some water going. Food, 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 bears, okay, yes. Meds, <gasps> meds, wrong ones, but meds, nice. Information has come down the pipeline that bows and arrows have been significantly buffed for this particular alpha, at least right now, as of uh, alpha 20B218. They haven't changed it at all, so bows are a very good thing to work with. Uh, their damage rate in comparison to the previous alpha is like over 50% better than the way, the way they were before. I don't see any trash I can pick that I need to worry about. I stole their chair. I don't know why I felt the need to steal their chair. It would really be really nice if I had some arrows. <laughs> How you doing? Okay. Unless, of course, it's the one that has the dog in it, in which case it's not okay. Okay, those are cupboards. Ooh, wooden crate. First aid bandages! Heck yeah! Uh, I'm not going to use those, so I will go ahead and put them down there. Hey, I've got a, I've got a red cap. Awesome. Uh, let's put you right there. Just out of curiosity, what is my loot stage right now? 
five. Not very much. Okay. Just to say, I picked up this uh, this thing right here. I, I probably should load that, by the way. There we go. I, I picked that thing up. That's a pretty decent level for a pipe pistol. I mean, a, a pipe auto weapon thingy. Thing. Uh, that's a pretty decent level for my loot stage. Then again, I, I didn't get it here, so it changes according to where you're at. So this is the dog one. Unless they changed where the dog is spawning. <gasps> Woo! Oh my gosh. I think I back there. Did it lose track of me? No, <laughs> it waited for me to open the door. Thank <laughs> it. 11%. 11%, guys. I haven't found any honey. Nothing. Hopefully after I finish this mission, he'll offer me some in a reward. That would be so great. Sandwich. Uh, what do you do nowadays? Food, health, dysentery. What recipes? You make antibiotics, but you have to have the recipe for it, so... Not exceptionally helpful there. Look at that coffee maker, though! Don't hit it again. Don't do it. Lots of glue. Um, I don't need to hit that. A lot of plastic in that thing. But I will take your stone. There's a few things. Okay, what's this? What is this? There's a couple of things like these uh, trophies and everything I'm probably just going to wind up selling, which is the reason why I'm not dropping them. I probably... These are the loot areas. I'm probably going to be better off if I try to set my stuff down. At, at least part of it to where I can walk again. I have already been snuck up on quite a bit, so let's craft that. Uh, I will eat that. A lot of different types of loot. Not a whole heck of a lot of anything, but a whole lot of different types. So, as soon as I get another point, I need to put that perk point into... Uh, not getting as hungry as fast. Fix those. Go. We've got some yuca. Could be helpful. Oh, jeez. If I could jump. Thank you. Okay. Here are my thoughts. Basically, this character is going to have a week or so in this town to loot and do things. And then we're going to move on to another town and we're going to loot and do things and fight hordes and stuff like that. But basically, moving from town to town, not staying in one place and building a huge base and all that, we are going to keep this character semi-mobile. Uh, which is the reason why I, I said I'm not exactly sure when and how the ending of this... Not ending, I say ending. Later game situation is going to happen for this character. I'm going to play it by ear because I don't know when the stable version is going to come out. You know what I'm saying? But hopefully this map will still be non-buggy when stable comes out. We can just continue on from there. Wake up thick! Come out here because I don't know if there's anybody in there with you. You... Okay, that's... Please, please, antibiotics. <gasps> Honey! I'm at 12%. This only does 5%, which means I still have to find another couple of things of honey in order for that to fully heal me. But it'll keep it from getting any worse until it runs out. So... We can put that... where should we put that? On here, I guess? Okay, dokie. That is good. Uh, did we actually finish the whole thing? I 
I guess that was the only loot that was left inside these buildings. It is a tier one, so I kind of understand. Okie dokie. Clear the area. We have finished. Talk to the trader. Let's go do the thing. We do not need the flowers. Uh, we need to be able to carry the duct tape. Definitely want to carry the duct tape. We can drop those. Um, for anybody who is new to the game, one of the hardest things to deal with in this game is inventory management. You're going to have to determine what kind of player you are, whether or not you like to build all the things or whether or not you like to loot and sell and buy the things on what you should actually keep. Don't let anybody else tell you, no, you definitely need to keep that because you, depending on your playstyle, it may not work for you. So as you go along and you figure out which part is the most satisfying part of the game for you, you'll slowly learn to figure what you use the most of. Like, uh, well, obviously, you probably aren't going to hold the flower. Ooh, hold on. Wait, 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 wait. I saw that out of the corner of my eye. There it is. Um, you'll probably realize uh, if we're in this biome, we don't necessarily need to hold on to the flowers for right now. Whenever we go to the burn biome, if somebody decides to drop flowers or something, we might want to hold on to that because we won't have any. Oh my gosh, that's that's a lot of stuff. Okay, scrap that. I'm not scrapping those. Uh, 44. This is no sell price, so there's no point in keeping it anyway. Let's see. We're probably not going to do the garden thing this time. I don't know. I'm, I'm thinking that at some point our character might retrace its steps back up north. In which case, if we happen to make the stuff to put plants in, we could put it outside of the traders. And when we drive back through, if we ever get a vehicle, we can just, you know, punch the plants or whatever and replant. It could be a thing that we decide to do. I don't know. Um, we can make food with that, so I don't want to use that one. Uh, we actually need that. The one blueberry, not a big deal. I probably should have just ate that. I mean, it's a whole one food right there, so... Just like this, but I can make that into food. This is sellable. Those are sellable. What are we doing on food? And this gives me ten. Another wrench. Okay. We will definitely need one of those. And besides, we'll probably also have to set up some kind of an outpost. We'll have a couple of them throughout town. We'll find a POI that doesn't have any zombies, or we'll build a small thing. And we'll put workstations outside of the towns, because like I said, we're going to keep our character mobile. And we'll have a bit of storage in each one of the towns, but basically from town to town, we're going to carry what we can carry. So we're staying here inside this town until we can get done with our tier 1 jobs and get a bicycle so we can move on to another town. Great weather. Here you go, friend. Whatever you oh, hang on. Uh, whenever you do that, if you can't pick up whatever stuff he's doing, um, if your whole inventory is full and you accept it, it will just drop it on the counter, which can despawn and can fall behind the counter. So if you tab back out of there, you'll be able to go back to his inventory, sell whatever you need to sell, and then go back and accept the quest. Or finish the quest out. Um, I will probably make boxes, so I'll hold on to those. Steel arrowheads might be useful. Leather I'm holding on to to make pockets. Um, I think that's it. Well earned, traveler. Well earned. 100 nine millimeters or shotgun shells. For Hordenite, I'm going to say these, even though I would like the shotgun shells. I do need another job. If you can give me... Uh, we can try a buried supplies and see if it gives me the stuff to fix my infection, maybe? Because you are not giving me any food or nothing. Good grief. Okay, let's go drop off. Uh, whenever we cleared this area right here, the only thing we had was a dog in the back room. So this might work as a place to set up an outside shop. And do that. Let's pull up our water and before we take off to go do another job, we'll just go ahead and get this crafting. It takes a while to make the water, so 
East Fan. There is a ditch over here where we should be able to find some water. Jeez, it's already 13th. Oh my gosh, a wolf. Oh, but that's a lot of meat though, you know? Nope. Don't waste it. Don't waste it. Don't waste it. I mean, it is meat, but don't waste it. Okay. Uh, did we have any other water that we could go ahead and bowl? Yes. Uh, these icons right here, we got the food, we got the drink, and we got the chemicals. Uh, cook all of those, and... Oh, I actually had eight more jars over here. They're sitting in the wrong section, that's fine. We can fill those up next time. Do we have anything else over here? Why don't we go ahead and make ourselves a pipe pistol, too? No, let's let's save those. Save those because I'll be tempted to carry it along with me. If I carry it along with me, I waste it. We might need those for Horde Knight. Speaking of which, we probably should look into Horde Knight stuff, but... Um, is there any food that we can cook? We've got one egg, so we can't do anything with that. Okay, go ahead and craft that and drop out the extra stuff. And we'll just run to our next objective while we're crafting. Dig quest man. I think we have to do 10 missions in order to get to tier 2 and at the end of tier 1 I have been told that you always get offered a bike and that is what we're going to go for so hopefully. Sorry Ed, I need the, I need the experience dude. I think there's a dog over here. Let me get this. Okay, okay, okay. Let's go. Let's go. Okay, now, unlike previous alphas, we actually have to activate this and then our icon is going to show up. So, let's make sure we are ready. No zombies around. And there it is. Alright, now, as soon as we pick up this, any any of the food supplies that the you get from the trader, it spawns in bad guys. And I will tell you, for the most part, it's really not worth sticking around and killing them. Uh, unless you just want the experience points. Okay? Wouldn't be a bad idea to get us some experience. I'm trying for a couple of perk points here. And the rest walked off. Ed, were you a part of this fight? I don't think you were a part of this fight, actually, sir. Okay, let's run. Keep our eye out for tree stumps because we are still needing honey. We are we are just about out of the honey that we actually got. So let me just take out. Not just you don't get as much honey or you don't find honey as often they also took out most of the tree stumps that's just rude dude you know what i might do is i might leave some of this stuff like in a trash can or something like that the lead and stuff that i'm probably not gonna do a whole first aid kits oh gosh that one's hard right there um three first aid kits or 109 millimeter I'm gonna say the 9mm, I guess. And of course, you are not carrying any of what I need, so... I thank you, kind sir. Um, we got buried supplies. We have got I some clear really zombies. Great. I look forward to seeing you again. Okay. Uh, we are not too far away from it. We probably could do like a quick drop-off and go get it. Like I said, oh my gosh. You know what? I am going to have to try for it. Let's 
It's worth the ammo. I need the meat. Let's sneak just in case we got anybody's attention. It was tempting me to sit here for too long. I had to. Alright, tier one quest. Clear area. Alright, how's about this? We're gonna run through and kill the bad guys before we do anything else because we don't want to have to fight the zombies at night. Woo! I did not realize you were standing down there, dude. My bad. I got excited to get my arrow back. No, they come it. Give me. Got it. Um. Hey. Okay. I think. How you doing? I do apologize. My, uh, what is it, the D button doesn't like to work properly? Alright, uh, this one is done. Let's grab the loot and head back. Yet another tier one, and we've had that before. Okay. Kits. Hey, book. Um, when in combat, recover one hit point with every punch. Okay. Work batch. Um, I will take apart this work batch. That's forged iron, and kind of need it. I probably should remember to take these apart from now on. Should. Doesn't necessarily mean that I will. I should. May or may not have gotten somebody's attention. Oh, I almost missed that. Incredibly useful. There's banging. What are you guys doing? Back on it. Don't get stuck. Ooh, lag. Okay, if she's gonna be distracted, I'm leaving. I might just, just make it back. Nope. Okay. You did it. Wait. Oh. Do do do. I'm taking this. There's zombies. You the modular home. I'm really not, but all right. Um. I have absolutely no armor to speak of to put that into. Okay. Uh, we can do a quick drop off. Do I have enough time to do that though? I don't know. If I can get in there and kill the bad guys as quickly as possible, I mean like as quickly as possible, I might have to house up inside that thing for the night, but I might be able to do it. Okay. Run! I can make it before nightfall. I can activate the mission and I can go in there and hide. I am just plowing through these missions hoping to find something useful. Some sort of antibiotic. Hopefully when I'm running around I might come across like a pharmacy or something too. I probably have already run past one and didn't see it. It just didn't register or something like that. Let's go down the alleyway. Why does it just keep making those random noises? It's 
Stop following me, lady. Uh, okay. But she's just gonna follow me. Hang on. I don't want her around the house either, just in case it hits nightfall while I'm inside. Alright, wait, 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 wait. Oh, daggummit, it saw me. Okay. Right? Nothing but cans, dude. Nothing but cans! Uh, I might have to come back out here and take those apart. I don't know. Ooh, okay. Uh, what are you doing? Okay. Uh, I don't know whether or not those things will give me the iron and stuff that I might need, so it would be a good idea to pick those up. Right, keep your fingers crossed. I'm rushing it. I'm pushing it. I probably shouldn't be pushing it, but I, I want this character in a position where she can go mobile should she need to. Which means doing this. Pushing for the loots. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I see a thing over there that might give me... Madison. Oh, it's locked open. That's not good. Okay. Please! That's not what I was looking for, but alright. Uh-oh. The lab lady. Can I? There we go. <laughs> I was just like, can I have my arrow back, please? I saw it for like a split second and it disappeared. Um... Oh, there she is. Oh my gosh. Let's stay sneaking. Can you just hold that? Hold that! Oh my gosh. guys there just gonna search this food really quick just in case anything stupid happens I don't want to be missing the foods you know anybody hiding anybody Somebody on the other side of the bed. And we got somebody up. Are they in here? Wait, meds, 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 please? No biotic? Oh. No antibiotic. We got somebody hiding up here. Oh. It's like a whole group of them. And Marilyn just... Okay. Okay. <laughs> Jason Borges is like, I'll just bring up the rear end. Hang on, there's one more mine. And that was everybody. Oh, come on. I, I need you to... I need you to break... Thank you. Do that before it hits nightfall, please. There we go. Oh, come on, please, please. Antibiotics. Are you kidding me? Seriously. Uh-oh. 
Got a couple of lockpicks, maybe. Maybe there's some good loot in here. I got it. That's right, even if I found a full fledged antibiotic, I don't think it would heal me up either. This is ridiculous. I don't want to be fighting the infection the entire time I'm playing the game. Are you joking? Yeah. Well, I know I'm going to be here the whole night, so might as well be beating on this the whole night. Oh, I got those. I can put those on. I read both of those. Oh, stamina's back. Just trying to spend some time the best way I know how. Go through my inventory while I'm waiting on my stamina to come back. A pipe machine gun at level 2. Um... It's only worth 12. I would kind of like it, like to get some pipes and fix them both and see whether or not it's worth selling. It's just, it's just not going to give it to me, is it, guys? Uh-oh. I hear a zombie. I'm gonna have to just sit right here. I can't pick at anything else anymore. Dang gum it. Gonna stop me looting. I thought they're playing around, which means it's close enough to hear me if I start messing with things. Alright, ladies and gentlemen, I'm just gonna sit here and wait until tomorrow. With a zombie so close to the house, I can't go break anything else down, so it's gonna have to wait until the morning anyway. So, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna hide. inside this bathroom in this corner right here. <laughs> I will see you guys in the next video. You have a wonderful day, a wonderful night, and you stay shiny. Bye!